I'm making a Muppet. I'm making a Muppet of myself <laughs> because I can. Because it's summer and I can and I want to. It's time to play the music. It's time to light the lights. We're making a Muppet on the Kelty show tonight. We can cut that. patterns that took way too long to make and then I put them on the foam and traced them and cut them out to have this. I'm ignoring my friends for this. Like how do I explain? Hey do you want to hang out? No I can't. I'm making a Muppet for the internet where no one follows me and I'm just doing this for myself. I'm not really sure how these are supposed to make a puppet head but I'm trusting the internet to get me through this. So while we're waiting for the hot glue gun to heat up, uh, we were reading Muppet trivia and uh, my mom just read to me that Sam the Eagle is a Capricorn and like I get that, but also, ouch. And I was thinking, what Muppet are you? Which Muppet do you find personally relatable? I would like to think I'm more like Gonzo, but in reality, oh god, I am Sam. So now I'm going to hot glue the sides together. This hot glue is taking a hot minute to solidify. That was so bad, I might cut it. Oh no! <laughs> also, you should probably eat dinner before you start something like this because now I'm really hungry, but it's like too late to stop. Ah! I cannot believe this actually worked. Does it look like me yet? This is seriously so much better than I was expecting because the pattern, I just couldn't see how it'd be a head, but like, this is a Muppet! Alas, poor York. All right, so we've let our girl dry and now it's time ooh, to make a mouth. All right, for this, just using a cereal box and winging it. So I cut out my cereal box and my felt, and now I'm going to hot glue them together to create the mouth of the puppet. Can you see that? Wait, shouldn't the felt go on the head before you put this on so it tucks under? Now I've taken the overwhelmingly large piece of felt and haphazardly folded it about my puppet's head, and I'm gonna pin it down. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> She's beautiful. <laughs> okay, so we've reached the point where this is happening, and I'm really not sure how to get this to stop happening. I feel like we just give her a real high pony. That just comes right out of her forehead, like a flesh ponytail. So just real quick, because this is really exciting to me. We bought the thread and the felt at two different places and different days, and look how close we got that. <sighs> okay, you can't judge me, because this is way harder than I thought it would be. It looks terrible. It's like I have a gash on my forehead. <laughs> I'm hoping the hair will cover it up, but I still don't know how I'm gonna attach the hair. Hold on, let me tie this first before I lose it. Oh, I'm losing it already. <laughs> it's been six hours, <laughs> but I'm having a great time. This is like my life dream. This is something like 10 year old me would think I was like infinitely cooler for. Look at her. She's coming along. She's a little rough. All right, so now that it's one o'clock in the morning, we're gonna make the body. More hot glue. It's time for more hot glue. There's stuff in my hair. <laughs> Ooh, she thick. This waistline is snatched. It is two o'clock in the morning. Oh, we are delirious over here, but we're having a good time. So it's so late that we're gonna have to finish this tomorrow. It's tomorrow. High five. Let me give you a hand with that. Do you need a hand? All right, update. So a few hours later, when we're finally done sewing this arm together by hand, it's time to put foam. Just wholesomely sewing this puppet skin together. I did the arms. It's late, but it's all good. It's coming along, slowly. All right, as you can see right now, I have changed clothes several times, and that is because this project is taking me so much longer than I thought it would. I started this, 
and it was summer. Let's just say it is no longer summer anymore. But I thought I would show you what I got. I've got my puppet body with the flesh covering it and a head. And I've sewed and stuffed two arms. Well, where the oh, it's here. So I need to sew all this together and then essentially we have her. Okay, so here's here's the deal. I originally thought I could get this whole thing done in one video, but now I'm kind of thinking I can't. So I think I might stop here so that you can see my progress and then tune in. I don't know when, but like hopefully soon and I will have it, I'll have her finished. What do you think? Well, thank you for tuning in so far. Uh, this has been really fun on my end. I hope that it's somewhat entertaining to you. If you enjoyed this video and you would like to inspire me to finish this project and not just leave it sitting around, could you please hit like and subscribe? <laughs> Your girl needs some motivation. I'm in my college semester now and it's difficult. I need I need a reminder to finish this. So if you're feeling like a help when I grow out, you hit that like and subscribe. Follow me on TikTok and Instagram at Kelty underscore gray. I will put it somewhere over here, maybe? I don't know. Not real good at editing. Oh, I dropped her arm. All right, that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Have a good like week or whatever. Subscribe. <laughs>